What's up, YouTube? It's me again, your girl, aka Krista. And I know y'all like, oh my gosh, I'm getting two in one night if I upload this today. So I think I found a better space to record. I think this is a little bit better. So um, I'm just gonna jump right into it. Um, I've been going thrifting um, and I haven't worn any of my items because I really wanted to show you guys, but I just didn't know a proper place to set up so that you guys can see everything but now this looks like it's working out okay you can leave comments and let me know if you guys can see everything okay but we'll jump right into it the first thing that i picked up and i'm happy i'm showing y'all that way i can go ahead and take it to the cleaners um to the two dollar cleaner because you know but the first thing i picked up was this nice skirt and it's pretty much like a um maxi skirt sorry my dog is there it's pretty much like a maxi skirt my table's not get too forgive me um it has this nice print on it it's pretty much like nautical inspired ropes navy blue and gold and it's pleated this was only five dollars and 99 cent and this was from um where was it from salvation army yeah salve so that's really cute i have some boots i'm gonna pair that with and i may wear it with a chambray top or maybe a gold top i don't know i have to see because you know i got that um that um polo blazer last year so i don't know i'm gonna do something with this all right next thing i picked up was this blazer and i just love this because it's screaming christmas oh my gosh it's already december okay so these are like pretty much christmas colors here it's pretty much like green like a hunter green gold red and black and then the collar here is trimmed like with the kind of like a suede material it's trimmed as well so i was thinking about pairing these with um I wish I had those like suede tights that, what was it? Not what says Charlotte Russe hat last year, but I forgot them. I didn't buy them, but it's okay. I still have this and I can pair it with like a skirt or something. I like the fit. It's not too boxy. It's a little bit boxy, but I can take these out. But let me show you guys. So this is the fit. Fits pretty nice. Not too big, not too small. I like it. And this was only $4.99, which is good because my Goodwill usually has blazers for $9.99. I hate paying that price, but it pretty much is what it is. All right, moving right along. I picked up a very nice belt, and it reminds me of, like, maybe someone, an equestrian, someone who rides horses or something. But this belt was only $2.99. Most of the belts at the Salvation Army are that price, but it's like this belt, like with the little double in here so you slide it and when well, you slide this under and then you put this in and then that's how you buckle it it's like a riding belt i really like it i thought it was really cute for the price so pick that up little big i also went to the jewelry section and i found this and i was so happy oh my gosh oh my gosh um this was like a dollar and 99 cent I ain't gonna lie, my Salve has like the best jewelry. Like I've tweeted some of it before. You guys have been like, Kristen, go back, and I've gone back and that wasn't there, but they have like some of the best jewelry, like no lie. So this is like a leather, it may not be leather, but a leather type bracelet, and it has an initial, and initials are really big right now. But um it happened to have the girl initial, K for Kristen. So I was happy to get this. Once again, it was $1.99. It's really small. Um, I don't know if you guys can tell, but my wrist it's really small, so it's gonna look good on it. Show is. All right. I also picked up these pants. I think these are so freaking hot. You guys may not like them, but I love them. They were four dollars and ninety nine cent, and it's pretty much like a high waisted pant. Um, you can tell that they are pretty much retro. They look huge, but I got enough junk in my trunk for them. They're pretty much just straight leg all the way down. And the colors are green, pink, yellow, black, and white. And I think this is something that I can pretty much turn fall by just putting on um, maybe a black blazer to tone it down a bit. But, of course, this would be definitely cute for the summer and the springtime with just a black racerback tank and some nice stripy heels. But, yeah, this is going to get worn. Please believe that. All right. Um... I was able to go home because my sorority, actually the line that I crossed on turned 10. So, um, yay, ski we to me and my line sisters. And so I was able to go home for homecoming and I stopped at this place um, that used to be like a storage, but they turned the whole place, like a whole 
area of storage units, they turn it into like this massive thrift store. And it's it's crazy, y'all. Like it is so freaking crazy. Like we just stopped on a whim. I was like, what's that? My cousin was like, girl, I think they turned to a thrift store. And I was like, oh, okay, let me just go in here. Ran in and I found this cute clutch. I mean, super cute. And I want to say it was um four dollars six ninety nine and this little tag just says genuine leather but it looks like it's freaking brand new you can flip this open has a little pocket right there and then right here on this end oops i broke it oh well you can just unzip it and it has like a little area right here and this is really big because sometimes when i go out like i'll have my heels but i'll also carry like some flip-flops and i will put them in my clutch honey i make sure that i carry a clutch that's big enough to like throw some flip-flops in so um this was 6.99 genuine leather loves it it's a nice color i think it matches a pair of boots that i have so super cute all right um as you guys know, I'm, houndstooth is in really big now. And the outfit that I wanted was, the whole outfit was at the thrift store, but the pants were a little bit too small, so I was unable to get those. But they were a pair of electric blue pants. And my thought were to wear this houndstooth um, shirt. This is actually Liz Claiborne, $4.99, with the um, electric blue pants and like a gold belt. But the pants didn't fit, and I was just like, oh my god. <laughs> oh my gosh but whatever there are more thrift stores and i can still do something else with this so this is really 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 cute i can take this um and just make it into a basic outfit by just like pairing it with like a faux leather black skirt and then jazzing it up with like some electric blue pumps or red or whatever but it's really cute and it's really um on trend for this season all right I also picked up this little thing. I don't even know what I would call it. I guess I would call it, I don't know, a coat or something. I don't know what to call it because it has like a rubber bottom. So it's not really, and it's open. So it's not really a shirt. So it's not a cardigan. It's like just something. But it's $5.99. I thought the print was a little bit African inspired. And I thought it would just look nice with just basically like an all black outfit. Like a black shirt some black leggings or black jeans or you know black jeggings but it's really high I don't know if this camera or um, this view would do it any justice if I happen to wear this I will do an outfit today it was kind of funky but let me show you guys so this is what I mean about the little rubber in the back please excuse my table talk about me if you want to I really don't care but um this is how it is I just think this is really, really cute. It probably like something that my grandma had, like, you know, back in the days. I probably could find this at her house, but whatever. I bought it. And I think I can wash it. Even if I can't, yeah, that's going to get washed. Just, I'm not spending $2. Oh, dry clean on. Guess I am. Okay. I also found another black and white shirt. I have a lot of black and white shirts from the thrift store because, you know, or I still work part-time at Lush, and um, I have to wear black and white there, which is it just is what it is. So um, I found this black and white shirt. I think it's so freaking cute. It almost looks like it could also be um, the house tooth print, which it probably is, but it is so cute. Um, it was only $4.99. And I have a lot of shirts that have like the little waistband here. I'm going to say this is probably late 70s, 80s style. Has the um, little shoulder pads here. I don't know if I'm going to keep those or not. But this is so effing cute to me. We'll see. But yeah. Hopefully I can wash it. And last but not least. It's not really last but not least. But last but not least. I found this um, jumpsuit. You guys can tell me what you think about it. I think it's awesome. It's cute. And of course, this has to go to the dry cleaners. But the top part of it is beige. It has a belt, which is like this, a rope belt. Really, really nice. And then the bottom part is blue. And it's like a couch print. <laughs> it's like flowers. I don't know if you guys can pick up on that print because I am recording from my Mac book. But let's see. You can see a little bit right here. But that's how it is. It's the same print in the sleeve, in the shirt part. 
and like I said once again the belt is pretty much gold I don't think I have a hanger or do I to see if you guys can see it better oh yeah I got a hanger right here so this is pretty much it right here whole little cat suit And it really, I mean, it's so cute. It has these little buttons right here that I pretty much need to see if they can tighten up a little bit so they don't fall off. These little gold buttons. But this is like the perfect holiday outfit. Now, I ain't going to lie to y'all a lot. It's a little bit, it's a little bit high waterish, But I could get the legs taper in a little bit. And I feel like that doesn't really matter because like now, like those styles are pretty much in where, you know, you can still wear a heel and wear a bad shoe and get away with it. Of course, um, for the holiday season, it's so easy to get away with sandals. So I looked at my car and I was giving away a box of stuff to the Goodwill again. And one of my coworkers, she likes to thrift too. So I gave her a pair of shoes that she happened to just see inside that I thrifted that were a size seven, but they were so cute. I was like, please let my foot grow. And it didn't. And then I asked my friends and they didn't want them because they don't thrift. A lot of them don't, but... I digress. But anyhow, these shoes were in there. And these shoes would pretty much look really, really nice with it. It's pretty much like a clear shoe. But it has some of that same print detail going on. And I bought these. They're J. Renee's, actually, which um, if you guys have parents. A lot of older women wear a lot of J. Renee shoes. Um, young people, too. But I'm just saying, I know my grandmother, like, they J. right eyes. But anyhow, um, I don't remember how much I paid for these. They got a yellow ticket on it. But I was going to give them away because I never wore them. And my um, co-worker was like, Kristen, oh my gosh. Because I was like, what shoes can I wear with them? I have no clue. And my um, co-worker was like, oh my gosh, you're going to give those away? Wear those. And these are, um, they fit nice. I just think that the back probably needs to be a little bit tighter. Because my foot is <sighs> really small. Maybe I can make another hole in the shoe. Because they have the little put the hole, pull it through type thing going on. But y'all, I'm going to work that out. I don't have nowhere to go. No Christmas party. If y'all live in the area, y'all want to invite me to one, please do. I wish I could go. It was something today for bloggers, but I just wasn't feeling it. Um, I just wasn't feeling it today to dress to go anywhere. So, that's pretty much it from my thrift haul. I guess it wasn't so big. Um, if you guys have any comments, um, just let me know. I wish I could prop I wish I could do like a thrifting meetup. I don't know. Maybe. Who knows? I don't know if anybody would even be interested in anything like that, but, um, you know, leave a comment. Um, let me know if you liked it. Let me know if you have any suggestions on what I should wear with it. And that's about it. Thank you guys for still subscribing to my channel, even though I haven't been updating on it regular. And thank you guys for, um, um, writing and leaving comments and just being, you know, good peeps. All right. Deuces!